My name is Matthew Bell. I'm the director of Memo. The film Memo is about the mayor of a tiny town in southern Italy. Uh, his town was decimated by depopulation, people moving out, getting jobs elsewhere in Italy and abroad. At the same time, his town was at the centre of the European uh, migrant refugee crisis. So refugees, migrants were arriving. He saw it as an opportunity. So the people arriving, they took the homes that had been left by other people. And then there's a local politics got involved, national politics, and it's about one week where everything comes to a head and we find out what's going to happen to the main character, the mayor, and also his scheme to help refugees. So I've worked in TV news production for quite a few years and it was a story that I was following. The main turning point was when the mayor got banished from his own town. He was born in the town, he became mayor and he was uh, exiled. He had to leave and live in a town nearby. And that for me was the, the main crux of the story. And then it came to April 2019. Uh, it was local elections. He, was, he came to the end of his term as a mayor, but then he wanted to still work in politics, keep his scheme going. But everything was coming together that week. There was national politics. There was the, the interior minister was against immigration. Basically, there was his local rival. And that was the week when it would all, you'd find out what's going to happen next. It was, it was really important because it seemed to tell lots of aspects of, of one story, which was the refugee crisis. If you are a refugee or a migrant and you do want to find a, a better place to live, what happens when you find that place and then the whole scheme is turned upside down? So it was, in some ways, it was just a, a prism for that story, to tell that story, which has been a, affecting Europe, other countries for years, and is doing so again for the UK right now. Uh, I am ecstatic, I am I'm made up that people are gonna see this on the big screen because it's been selected by quite a few festivals, but I've not been able to go or they've not been in person. So I'm just, yeah, thrilled to see it on the big screen and hear what people think about afterwards.